Hyperlinks. Let, let's talk about hyperlinks. So any object in AutoCAD can have hyperlinks associated to it, whether it's a block, a piece of text, or just a piece of simple line geometry. When I look at this text and look at the properties of it, you'll see there is a hyperlink field. I'm going to hold down control and click on that text and it opens up whatever that hyperlink was. In this case, it opens up another drawing. In the case of something like a shop layout, you can actually use hyperlinks and link to a manufacturer's website. It gives you details of the machine, brochure for the machine. You could also, whoop, bring back my AutoCAD here. Uh, you could also link to another file, like you saw it linked to a drawing file. This time I've linked it to a company spreadsheet that gives me the machine, some capabilities of the machine, and what jobs might be run on that machine. The way to build a hyperlink is you simply select the object, whatever that object is. In this case, I'm just going to zoom in and use one of these lines of the guardrail. Select that object over in the properties palette on the hyperlink field. Just click the edit hyperlink box and you can link it to a file or to a web page. In order to activate that hyperlink, you simply hold down the control key and click that geometry and it will open that hyperlink in either another window, internet window, AutoCAD window, or the other application in the case of the Excel file. 